So there you go. Um, I guess we could go down a bit more, iron more. Maybe might come in handy because in hard mode you can actually do some, do a little bit more with these ores. And what can you do? Um, you'll see it sometime in the last play, but right now it's not really that useful. And man, there's quite a lot of iron ore, iron ore in here. Shoot. Um, might come in handy if I'll ever remember to actually go down here to collect a bunch of iron ore. So, yeah. Might be useful for something. Well, going through hard mode, and I think I saw another new enemy over here. These. Oh, Toxic Sludge. These are basically like, um. Well, they're not like basically slimes, but they're basically like a toxic version of a slime, like a recolor. Oh, I guess they are kind of slime because they do drop gel. So yeah, there's these are like the toxic versions of slimes. When I'm getting attacked, you can get like poison or like yeah, like a poison stat that uh, slowly reduces your health, but only for a few seconds. So yeah. Well, a stat or actually like a debuff for you. So yeah, be a little bit careful with those guys, but they're not really that hard to kill, and they don't. And they don't give you, and you won't take that much damage from them. They're not really like that offensive in terms of its own stats. Okay, maybe a little bit, like 42 damage, but they're you can you'll kill them pretty fast, so you won't take you'll probably won't take that much damage from them. Uh, shit. Yeah, in, in this recording, if you'll. Here's some background noises. It's probably my dad, so yeah. But really, this it's nothing that I can do about those background noises. So yeah, sorry if there will be some background noises in this recording. So yeah, and in the previous few recordings, it happened quite a quite a lot, as I've heard. Oh, I'm actually, I actually run out of freaking torches, so I'll actually make some. And I'm full. Well, actually, get rid of this copper ore. Oh, I thought it was. Ooh, I see. I see the new ore. It's cobalt. This this is what cobalt looks like. It's a blue blue ore. And personally, I like the blue color blue. It's my personal. It's uh, it's actually my favorite color blue. Well, mainly, what kind of like type of color is aqua blue. And this is not exactly aqua blue, it's kind of like a dark blue color, but it still, it still looks pretty cool. And well, I mean, it still looks pretty cool, the ore itself, so, yeah. And this ore will be pretty useful, definitely useful. You will need this for the, for getting more ores, like mithril. And with mithril, for adamantite ores, and yeah. Okay, how much ore did we get? 40? Yeah, not bad. This is a this has been this was a pretty good um uh cobalt or spawn or of some sort, so yeah. Topaz, I'll gladly take that might come in handy. Uh making colored torches or other stuff that I can make with topaz if I'll ever need it. Oh these are new enemies too, the anglerfish. If if that's their name. Yeah, Anglerfish. These are like the upgraded versions of the Piranhas. They're really deadly enemies. One of the strongest common enemies in the game. They'll do a lot of damage, like believe me, a lot. And this one is pretty new too. It's sort of a bad, but I can't remember their name right now because I don't notice, don't always notice it. And I'm getting quite full again, so I'm kind of wondering if I want to go back to the surface and get rid of most of the stuff and I guess I will because I am getting kind of full and try to make some cobalt bars and it was and well yeah since we're here we might as well make some um, cobalt cobalt bars from our cobalt wars so yeah uh, let's see come on quick stack more items yeah. Getting somewhere. I 
quick stack and stuff. And yeah, this should be good enough. I'll just pretty much sell some stuff for, from this um, for this arms dealer. Yeah, the spear and the light crystal, and that's pretty much it. I won't sell the bar, uh, the star club because that might be pretty useful once I'm not gonna use the sorcerer emblem for a while. So yeah, I'll just put this and put this down in the. Um, in the accessories chest. Uh, okay, now let's make some bars. And actually, with these um, cobalt ores, with the uh, stone block, you can make cobalt brick, and it looks pretty cool. But really, remember this: that uh, cobalt ores are not as common as you think. Well, maybe they are a little bit, but not as common as like iron ore copper or stuff like that you know so do remember that and what should I make first I don't know you can make a plenty of stuff like these like the cobalt naginata this is like a spear of the cobalt this is like a sword this is like a bow but this one's a really good bow better than the molten fury personally well slightly bit better it has more range damage but yeah Cobalt chainsaw, probably not gonna make this anytime soon, but yeah, might be might come in handy later for making a whole bunch of stuff for making one of the most powerful weapons in the game. So yeah, eh, I can't really make as much. So I'll pretty much go back to the cave I was earlier. I guess I'll use the bridge over here. Because that'll, it'll probably be a bit faster to go through. So yeah. Yeah, super fast! Super fast! Uh, yeah, let's keep, just keep going, just keep going. And kill the slime while you're at it. And take two damage from it because I suck. Well, man, not really. You take damage quite quite often in this game, so yeah, it's, not, it's no big deal that I still take damage from really weak enemies, like really early enemies, so yeah, it doesn't matter. And we... Yeah. Let's do some parkour action with these blocks. With our... Um... Spectre boots and with our running powers. Yeah. Yeah. Alright. Come on. What was that cave over there? Oh, a little bit of a lag right there. But it wasn't a big one. Don't worry about it. So I wouldn't worry. Well, at least for me. We. That didn't take long. And. Yeah. And let's go um, mine more stuff. Mine, mine more cobalt and find more loot. So let's go. So let's do this, baby. Okay, yeah, there's quite a lot of water in here. I mean, God. Like a lot, there's a lot of these water, like a lot. Like, you know, a lot. You already get what I mean. Jeez. Stop being so obvious, Arthur. Seriously. You're so stupid. Uh, let's see. Oh, that's Mithril right there, but I can't really mine it just yet. Because I need the Cobalt Drill to do it. To mine this stuff. Uh, let's see. What was that? Oh, these guys are really hate as well. Not as much as the Corruptors because they don't spawn as much. But I really hate these guys. They are more skeletons. And also in hard mode, once you go to the underground, to the underground, there's new, more new underground enemies like the upgraded versions of the skeletons and that 
was the armor skeleton. The the they're pretty defensive and they can do a little bit of damage to you, quite a bit of damage. But really, the main thing I really hate about them is they they that they have a debuff. They for five minutes they can give you half of the defense. Like if I would have gotten a debuff from the armored skeleton, I would have 15 defense right now instead of 30. So yeah, that's not good. And for five minutes. So yeah, it's a really nasty debuff and I really hate it. I get it pretty regularly. You get it pretty commonly. Once you get at least like, if you get like at least three heads from the skeleton, you probably you'll have a chance you'll probably have a chance of actually getting the debuff so definitely be careful of fighting those guys because they can be pretty nasty but they don't spawn as common as like um the upgraded slimes so like those toxic slimes and other stuff and right here is the the other upgraded enemy which is the skeleton archer these guys are pretty nasty too. They spawn a lot more commonly than the, the armor skeletons, but they're pretty annoying as well. Well, basically, the main reason that they're annoying is that they do a lot of damage to you. They they hit you quite a lot with their bows, and yeah, they're not really exactly fun to be fighting. They're not really fun to fight against them, so yeah. And oh yeah, these are the new, the new bats, the armor, the upgraded bats, the, um, the giant bats. They're basically like a slightly stronger version of the bats, but they're not really that special in terms of of like what their stats are. They're basically a bit stronger. They have a little bit more health than the bats, but they have but they don't have no debuff, so they're not really exactly. Good ones. Oh shit. Ah, he's getting me pretty badly. Yeah, heard of him. Good thing I didn't get his get his stat yet. Let's use use some harpoon harpoon spam, alright? Yeah. But as you see right there, you don't it's not doing that much damage. Oh fuck. I got killed and I lost my gold coin. My gold coin. And I actually saw something earlier that I got the debuff from that. I think it can look better this way. No, I don't. Um, what was I earlier? Um, like they gave me the debuff of that, of giving me that half defense. So yeah, I got killed pretty quickly right there, and that wasn't a good spot to actually be fighting them. So yeah, that's probably that was probably not good on my part. That wasn't good on my part, I mean. Uh, yeah, now I just need to go all the way back to the underground area I was and rematch those guys again if they're still there. I doubt it, but maybe they'll still be there. Maybe. Maybe. Let's keep flying, let's keep running, let's keep super fasting. Is that even a word? Probably not. So, if that's not a word, then yay, I come up with a new mm, name. Like a, uh, or not, not like a name, but a new word. So, yeah. Super fasting. We're super fasting, this bitch. Ah! Oh no, not these guys! <laughs> Man, he really scared me right there. That thing. Oh, I really hate these. This is like a mini box, the, the Wyvern. They're not fun enemies to fight, really. I, at this point, just stay away from them. Try to run away from them. Because they're not fun enemies to fight. Not a fun box to fight with at this point. And I guess you can still fight them, but be very careful of fighting them. And, oh, actually, I passed up the little, um, underground area, so let's just run! Run away! Ah! Ah! Stay away from me, you stupid violin! Jeez, you're not supposed to be here!
Is he away? Has he gone away? Thank God. I'll just give myself a safe spot because I don't trust myself to actually progress through this underground area again. So yeah. So um nice place. So I'll just wait right here, so um <clears throat> Uh, about the Vyron, I'll explain about them later once I'm really prepared, once I feel like I'm ready to fight them, but right now I don't feel like fighting them, so yeah. 36, and just 36 minutes in just recording so far, jeez, it doesn't feel like it ha has gone by that, that fast, but hey, whatever. Uh... Man, my voice is really tired right now for some reason. Maybe it's because of that screaming, of running away from that wyvern. I mean, good lord. I was sure unlucky of getting that guy. And really get ready. And that's not gonna be the only time you'll get you'll get this guy. Um, trust me, those you're gonna be annoyed by that wyvern. Seriously. Really, like. Sometime, like most of the time that he spawns, you wish that he didn't spawn because really he's a pain in the ass most of the time and really you just want to stay away from him. And you can get a chance of getting, and there's a chance you can get yourself killed if that guy spawns. So, yeah, he's not a fun enemy to deal with. And actually, I think that's the cobalt right there. Um, is this a mimic? No, it isn't. Oh, not you again. Not you again! Alright, get rid of you with my knight's edge. Yeah. Oh, not so fast. Oh, they do have a debuff, the confused debuff. That can be a little bit annoying. Stay away from me, you son of a bitch. I'll knock you back. I'll knock, I'll knock you back into the pit. I'll knock you back to the pit. I said I'll knock you back to the pit. To the pit. Okay, let's see what we have here. On uh, the bottle. Eh, not that useful. But at least I got some gold from that. Um, like nine gold bars, so eh. It's worth something. So now let's mine this cobalt ore. There's quite a lot, actually. And actually, I wanted to explain this earlier, but I didn't get to. You can, there's, um, with cobalt ore, for the most part, there's like, there's like huge stacks of it. So, um, definitely expect a lot of this, a lot of cobalt ore to spawn at, with huge stacks. So, yeah. But it's also pretty useful to have huge stats because you can get a good amount of co-op bars pretty early, pretty fast. You can get a lot of cobalt bars pretty early. Actually, let's yeah, let's use the um, hellfire arrows against this these guys because it's a pretty open area for the most part. Oh my God, there's three of these armored skeletons. Not getting really lucky spawn with these guys. Keep firing, assholes! Why do I keep why do I keep referencing that? I don't know. It's because of me firing. And it's like keep firing, assholes. And if you don't know what movie I'm I'm referencing, it's space balls. I'm pretty much quoting a movie and that is space balls. Yeah, just keep firing, but I'm not doing that good amount of damage. For the most part. Oh man, they're like in one spot. And I killed both of them at the same time, so that's lovely. Uh, <laughs> you can't catch me. And now I fire you. I kill you. Run away, because I'm on a massacre around here. Yeah. 